and welcome back to my channel. My name is Vicki and in today's video we're going to be setting up June's budget in my Erin Condren life planner. Um, I think it's called the monthly deluxe maybe? Monthly? So we are coming into June. Oh my god half the year is gone. Where is 2020? 2022 gone. Jeez. Okay so I have my Erin Condren um, sticker books. I have collection five, six, and seven. I do have the Happy Planner Seasonal. I have Erin Condren. Um, I don't know what these are called. They're circle dot things. And then I have Planner Kate um, payday stickers. So let's go ahead and put some of these down and talk a little bit about June. So let's go ahead and pick... Uh, this looks like the color for June. For June, um, this first week, I consider it still in May. Anything that has at least three or more days, and it, typically I start my budgets on Sunday, so if it starts on a Sunday and there's three days, I at least count it in the month that the week falls in, if that makes sense. So we get paid on the 15th, for June and then we're gonna get paid on the last day of the month and um, we're also gonna get paid here but again that counts for June do I want to put a third payday here mm. yeah we'll put one of these guys just to denote it And this I signify, so I get paid on the 15th and the last day of the month. Jim gets paid on the last day of the month. And we'll go ahead and put a sticker here. Just letting us know he's getting paid here too. Okay, so that's the payday stickers. We got those down. Let's go ahead and put those away. I use Carajo plans for my um, expenses, weekly expenses, if you catch my videos. All right, um, June. So that might, and when I say that, I mean all of these. Okay, so back to June. We have, I was looking at the stickers ahead of time, and I like these. Um, I'm not crazy about these circles here, but I am going to use the Hello Summer. I think it looks pretty here uh oh I have screaming kids never last long we are gonna go on a road trip so I'm gonna put this sticker up here so excited we're taking the kids to Oh, Father's Day. What day is Father's Day? Oh, Juneteenth. Same day. Cool. I actually have... I'm going to put it up here just because this is where I put my expenses. Maybe I will put it here just to signify it's the weekend. And I also have this day off because Juneteenth is now a federal holiday. So we get it off. At least at my job we do. Let's see, anything else? Nope. All right. I also have my Dollar Tree calendar that I have for where I have the kids' stuff and our all right, this is what I usually take with me outside of my, like, I don't know, when I'm traveling and stuff. Put this back over here. Okay, so let's put that away. Let's see, do we have anything else here? I kind of just made June stuff available. So again, this is what we put down our stickers for, so I'm not going to worry too much about putting too many. Oh, I 
guess I didn't put paydays on May. Did I not do a May setup with you guys? Let me see, did I do it with April? Yes. Okay. All right, the other thing we do is we, where is my pen? All right, so we do goals. <laughs> you guys are gonna laugh because I didn't do my four, rollover <laughs> one of these days. 401k do this month. Do this month. Let's take a look at our yearly thing that I created at the beginning of the year that goes over the year at a glance. For the month of June, we have trash and pest. Actually, pest is a little off kilter because it was actually last month, so I'm, not, I'm just going to leave trash. i got to add the debt here. This is where I used to put my videos, but I will put the birthdays for Oh, we don't have any birthdays in June. Okay. All right, so let's go ahead and see what we do. Let's do it's in April. Okay, sinking funds, sinking funds tracker, weekly check-in. Okay, sinking funds, sinking funds tracker, weekly check-in. Let's do the weekly check-in on this side because I don't like to write against the coil. Sinking funds tracker. And sinking funds. And let's just. I'll set these up. Do I set them up? I usually set them up on a separate um, video. So we'll do that on the next video. The weekly check in. Let's go ahead and use some of these stickers. Which book am I using? Edition six. Um, let's do edition seven. I think they had monsteras. Yeah. So I told you about our vacation plans, and I'm excited about that. We've already paid for it, and we're gonna go and stay in Los Angeles and use points. So I'm excited about that as well. And then, oh, I guess I should have, oops, moved it over a little bit. This is the one thing I don't like about Aaron Condren stickers is they rip really easily. Let's see. Yeah. Shoot. Oh well. I'm just gonna rip it. Okay, and then we'll go ahead and set up one with you, and then I'll do the rest in a set, you know, by myself. So I'll go ahead and do this right now. Um, I'm excited for June because summer starts, and my kids will be home. Well, my son and my husband, and then um, what else? We're going to have that little vacation week category spent remaining. Oh, oh well. Remaining spent category and week. And then the first week, what did I say? The 5th or the 11th? One, two, three, four, yeah. The 5th or the 11th. And then we track groceries, gas, dining out, unexpected. And then I'm going to put the budget up here. It's going to be 800, 800, 
250, 300. And if you caught my video from yesterday, I believe we said it was going to be 2150. Then I will double check here in a second. Let me just look here really quickly. 2150. It's a lot of money. <laughs> so we'll track how much we spent, how much we have remaining, and we'll have a week one total. And then, you know, I'll do the rest. We'll do groceries, gas, dining out, unexpected, etc. The line, week two, totals. Okay. So other than that, that is our plan with me for June. We'll do sinking funds in a separate video. Um, we have our road trip planned, the trip I was telling you about. I'm excited to see how we do for the month of June because the month of May was a train wreck, hot mess. We spent too much money. I hope you found this video entertaining. Thank you for hanging out with me. If you enjoyed it, please give me a thumbs up. If you're not subscribed, please consider subscribing. And I look forward to seeing you in the next video. Take care. Bye.